The following is a class on the Srimad Bhagavatam, first canto, sixteenth chapter, text number twenty-one, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on January seventeenth, nineteen seventy-four, in Hawaii. Translation: The earthly deity in the form of a cow thus replied to the personality of religious principles in the form of a bull. O Dharma, whatever you have inquired from me shall be known to you. I shall try to reply to all those questions. Once you too were maintained by your four legs and increased happiness all over the universe by the mercy of the Lord. Bhavan Hibida Tassardam Janmang Dharmanu Pichis So, Dharmaraj, uh, Jamaraj, he is one of the twelve authorized persons for maintaining properly the human civilization. The principle is uh, Dharma. Dharma means not a religious sentiment. Dharma means occupation and duty. Uh, everyone has got some occupation and duty. <coughs> so, dharma hi sakshat bhagavat panitam. That occupation and duty is assigned by the Supreme Personality of God. Tena taktena bhunjitha. Actually, the dharma principle, as we learn from Bhagavad Gita, uh, Krishna says, sarva dharman paritajya mamekam saranam. Don't create, manufacture your principle of <coughs> religion. Concoct. That is the difficulty. Dharma uh, means hakshad bhagat We have several times explained this. The dharma means, uh, dharma, as it is translated in English, religion. Religion means to obey the laws of God. That is religion. Uh, <coughs> not a, a sentimental system of religious system we manufacture. Uh, that kind of dharma will not uh, help us. Therefore, in the uh, Srimad Bhagavatam, in the beginning, it is said, dharma projita koitavatra, cheating type of religious system is kicked out. That is Bhagavatam. Uh, no cheating. Uh, in the name of cheating, uh, and dharma, religious principle, that will not help the human civilization. Uh, the real dharma, uh, the real dharma is stated by God Himself. Dharma to Sakshad Bhagavat You haven't got to learn from anywhere else but from God Himself. Uh, so that is explained very nicely in the Bhagavad Gita. Sarva Dharma Anparitajyama. To surrender to the Supreme Personality of Godhead, that is really. Not only surrender, but to act as he desires. Or you become a lover of God. That is first class religion. We have several times explained. Samai Pungsang Paro Dharma, Jato Bhakti Radhukhaji. That type of religion is first class, which teaches you how to become a lover of God. If you become lover, then your life is successful. Then you will do everything for God. Otherwise, you will simply question, why shall I do that? Why shall I do that? Why shall I? That means there is no love, that is training. 
just like a, a novice is being trained up and he has no love, so he will question, uh, why shall I do it? Why shall I do it? Why shall I do it? What benefit has in it? Uh, so many questions will be there. But when there is love, uh, there is no question. Uh, so therefore in the Bhagavad Gita, after teaching so many things, yoga, jnana, karma, and so many other things, uh, at last Krishna said, the sarva guyatamam, now I am speaking to you, the most confidential uh, instruction. What is that? sarva dharma paritajya maami This is the most confidential. So, uh, generally a human being uh, accepts four principles, namely dharma, artha, kam, moksha. Dharma, artha, kam. Dharma means religious principle. Artha means economic principle, how to uh, develop economic principle. Dharma, kam, uh, how to uh, satisfy our senses and moksha and ultimately salvation. But this is material principles. Uh, we have to surpass this material principle, then come to the spiritual platform. That is sarva-dharma and paritajya mahavi Sarva-dharma, this is also dharma. Uh, uh, just like people are engaged, uh, for many, uh, their temple charge is sometimes simply formality. Uh, real, uh, their real business is how to satisfy their senses. If for satisfying my senses I'll have to pose myself as a religious person, so let me do that. That is their religion. Uh, but that is not religion. Real religion is, uh, knows sense satisfaction simply to satisfy the Supreme Lord. That is real religion. Therefore he says, Bhavan hi Veda tat sarvam. So as uh, somebody, anything, they require four legs, just like this platform, it has got four legs. An animal stands on four legs. Anything, it requires four pillars. So uh, to remain uh, steadily on the platform of dharma, uh, these four legs require dharma, artha, kam. If I simply remain engaged in religious principle, and nobody uh, is engaged but to get food, because food also requires. So therefore not only religious principle, there must be uh, economic development attempt also. Uh, but not one man so. Uh, we should divide our society in such a way that somebody, uh, some group of men is engaged in studying the dharma principle and spreading it. Just like we have taken the principle uh, generally to spread what is meant by real dharma. Uh, that is the business of the Brahman. Uh, and similarly, uh, some group of men should be khatriya uh, for ruling over. Uh, unless there is discipline, ruling, everything will be chaos. Uh, the government must be there. The principle of uh, directors must be there. So dharma, artha, kama. And we must live peacefully. Our senses should not disturb us because we have got senses. They want satisfaction. Uh, so we must give food to them also, uh, senses. Dharma, artha, kama, and moksha. But ultimate goal is how to get out of this material existence. This is four principles. Dharma, artha, kama.